We get fresh water from ponds, rivers, lakes, and underground sources. When pollutants such as wastes from factories, houses, and farms mix with the water in freshwater resources, we call it water pollution and such wastes are known as water pollutant. Causes of water pollution In our daily life, we use water for variety of tasks. We use it for bathing, washing utensils, washing clothes etc. When the waste water from these activities mixes into fresh water sources, it causes water pollution. Industries use various raw materials and process them. During these processes, chemical waste is formed and when it mixes in water, it causes water pollution. Farmers use fertilizers and pesticides to get good yield from crop. Fertilizers get dissolved in water and absorbed by plants. But plants can absorb only certain amount of fertilizers, and when excessive fertilizers are used, some amount of it stays dissolved and gets washed away to water sources. This results in water pollution. Solid wastes such as polythene, plastics, when dumped into water sources, becomes water pollutant. Water pollution is becoming a very dangerous problem day by day. Various diseases such as cholera and diarrhea are caused by using polluted water. Let's discuss few steps to reduce water pollution. We should never directly dump the sewage water into fresh water resources. Instead, it should be first treated in sewage treatment plant and then released into water bodies. A sewage treatment plant removes impurities from polluted water. Fertilizers and pesticides should not be used in excessive quantity. Instead, use of manure and natural fertilizers should be encouraged. We can always reuse the wastewater to grow plants in the garden. Solid wastes should not be dumped in water bodies and should be treated separately.